Who is Tal Set in the Turok series? Born in the year 1840 to the Saquin Nation in Texas, Tal Set's childhood remained a mystery, but going into adulthood, he grew up to be a brave warrior that defended his tribe. In the year 1886, his people were attacked by Captain Tobias Bruckner and his men. Mr. Bruckner was known to have a hatred for American Indians. He was given the name of Red Snake because of his history of being ruthless. Tal Set's people were killed off until only he and Chief Grey Bear remained. But right before Grey Bear died, he activated a special stone. And as Tal Set fought against Mr. Bruckner, he cut off his arm and knocks him off the ledge. But then, the ancient stone activates a portal and pulls them both into the lost land. He is found by the river people and their leader named Tarkeen. Meanwhile, Captain Bruckner is recruited by the Sleg, who are at war with the river people. Bruckner is then given a robotic arm to replace the one he lost at the hands of Tal Set. Tal Set would eventually meet Mr. Bruckner and defeats him along with his Tyrannosaurus Rex, but as the beast falls, it crushes Mr. Bruckner and he lays there, trapped, until he is eaten by Compsognathus dinosaurs. Now, in an alternate ending, Tal Set has the option for sparing him or killing him. If he is spared, Mr. Bruckner becomes overwhelmed with guilt for his actions and decides to kill himself with a grenade. After saving the people of Galliana, Talset is given the mantle of Turok from Tarkeen, and he becomes the Son of Stone. As the ceremony ends, Tarkeen hopes that Talset does not become consumed by choosing the path of war. His story would continue in the Lost Lands as he defended against the evil cyborg, the Campaigner. This new enemy came to this land in search of the ancient Chrono Scepter weapon. It was a destructive weapon created thousands of years ago. The campaigner was in search of this weapon so he could rule over the other worlds. But first, the weapon had to be assembled from eight pieces. It was originally dismantled by the elders of the Lazarus Concordance in an attempt of keeping it away from the hands of evil. Tal Set would battle through the Lost Lands and infiltrate his base killing off many of the campaigner's minions while also slaying Thunder, the cyborg T-Rex. He then finds all eight pieces of the Chrono Scepter and assembles it. He would use his powerful weapon to defeat the campaigner and escape his fortress. And after these events, the Chrono Scepter weapon is thrown into a volcano to be destroyed, so it is never used again. And in doing so, this causes an earthquake that awakens the Primogen. It was asleep for a millennia, but now it has awakened. And this is where the story of Tal Set ends. Now he was also known by other names like the Valiant One and the Fury of Hope. Now Tal Set made an appearance in the multiplayer of Turok 2 Seeds of Evil, but in Turok Rage Wars he appeared as a final boss. But this time he was covered in bulky armor with a headdress that could be of Saquon origin. His armor also had mythical symbols and sigils. Although this appearance of Talset differs, there was no explanation as to why he was changed, but my theory is that this could be the version of Talset that was worn by Tarkeen when he said, I pray that you will not be consumed by war. Now the meaning of Turok is basically a title of the one who must protect the barriers between this dimension and the others. This is actually different when compared to the original comic book story, which explains Turok is the name of one of the two brothers trapped in the Lost Valley, and according to the comic books, Talset was listed as dying in the year 1925, which would have made him 85 years old. And that was the story of Tal Set. Now if you're a fan of the Turok franchise, did you play the video games and which one is your favorite? Let me know in the comment section. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to leave a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more videos like this in the future. Thanks for watching. My name is Acid Glow, and I'll see you in the next video.